Well, we got ourselves a little walk. It's uh, about a 15 minute walk down the old bed here. We're in New Brunswick, Canada on our annual bear trip. And the cool thing about this trip is you have a nice little bonus opportunity for some smallmouth fishing. We're in a little stream called the, I think the Aroostook is what they call it. Anyways, we're about a mile below a big hydro dam. Water temperatures, oh, probably mid 50s right now, if I was guessing. Seems like they're about a month behind our weather back home in West Virginia. But anyways, we hit this about every year. We got about a 15 minute walk down to the stream. This kind of puts you in the mindset of a lot of, like a miniature New River back home. <clears throat> Dark, almost a black uh, rock bottom. You have some swift water, you got some pools. Mixture of narrow and wide. But anyways, I had uh, quite a bit of rain here last week. First couple of days of this trip. The river was almost unfishable. But this particular stretch we're walking into, we, we try to hit it every year. It's nothing else, it's a very picturesque stretch of the river. Some white water, a lot of rock structure. But anyways, we got about a two hour section here. We can fish, be all bank fishing, waiting. We got two or three guys with us. And if you can hit it just right, it's some world class smallmouth fishing. If you don't hit it just right, you still got some pretty good odds of pulling in a handful of fish here before you leave. But we'll see. We've got a little bit of time to get down this way. About another 10 minutes or so to go. And we'll be after them. weed your way through here there's usually a trail or two you can just find and work your way through there um, it might it might but it's it's just a little piece to get through here huh yes If I can get there, we get right over here first. Huh? There he is. Wearing them out already. Um, trying to think. Huh? Yeah, right here.
Look in the outside pocket here. Uh huh? Oh yeah. Catching right up on the bank. Outside pocket. Yeah. It's about the team right here. Yeah. Yeah. Two pounds, 14 ounces. I figured you'd get a little better than that. That's a good one. I mean, it's strong. Not very fat, but it's long. Maybe she may have already dropped her eggs. I might try to get out to that current out there in a minute. That's, that's my favorite spot out there. Huh? Where's your paper? Right out here. Both those two pockets, yeah. Did it really? Look. Ooh. That's pretty solid fish. <laughs> Good tug. Good tug. Good tug. That's what we come to Canada for, right there. Look at the color. The bronze back here in the pretty water. That's, that's spectacular stuff right there. Beetle spin, quarter ounce, gold blade, split tail, fat Albert, pumpkin seed, watermelon color, I'm sorry, watermelon color. That's rocking right there. If I can reach that point, Come off that point. If I can reach that clear water there, I think I can pull a fish out of it. Getting it. There he is. Just a little guy. Just a little guy. But we'll take him. We educated him. Oh yeah, he just couldn't help himself. Well, he got her down in there deep too. Gonna need some surgery on him. Oh, oh he took it deep. Oh, yeah, he did. yeah, I'm on there, big guy. See where the water's been up there last couple days. A little high. Did you? I just don't think I can get over there right now, Steve. Yeah. Pull a little up. 
right out here and then right below. Just don't think I can get there, brother. I'm just trying to figure out where I can get and not interfere with you. Don't want to, don't want to be screwing you up, any. There's where we want to be. That looked pretty good. Right along this. Just a little fella. Doing a straight retrieve on them too. Oh, really?
Wearing them out. Was it six or eight in this little pocket right here? Yeah. yeah. I've had a, a fish or a hit. Huh? pushing noon so we're gonna go and bail out of here what we found today is that this uh, water has certainly cleaned up just a little bit over the last couple days a lot of green a lot of natural colors there today still using that quarter ounce beetle spin as the main profile uh, we're about out of gold uh, that's our preferred color obviously but uh, you know we're on to the silver blades now but the, the biggest thing that we're seeing right now is this water is actually fishable for the first time really all week um, you know, a lot of smaller fish, a lot of quantity, just not much quality. We had, uh, I don't know, half a dozen or so between the group. That's going to run in that three pound range. Uh, still good fish, but the beauty of that is you get, as you can see behind me, you get just a little bit of, little bit of resistance uh, with a pound, two pound fish in this swifter water, and it's, it makes for some pretty entertaining times. But uh, the, the, the bigger ones uh, do have a belly on them. They've not dropped their eggs yet, so you, know, you might find some, some females on the nest. Uh, looking at that transition water from your pools into the uh, the swift water. So, uh, water temperature is still pretty cool. Uh, it's a little warmer than what I was figuring. I think it's probably upper 50s right now. But it was a good day. You know, I'd say between the group of us, we had four of us here. I'd say we put probably a hundred and I don't know, 125, 130, maybe even 140 smallmouth on the bank here, just in about a two-hour stretch. So, anyways, it's uh, just about lunchtime. We're heading back to camp. We've got about an hour drive. New Brunswick, Canada. It's uh, good, borderline great, but it is not spectacular just yet. But we have uh, we have a little bit of hope for the rest of the week.